Hey, welcome, it's KB here. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a new Chromium based operating system for PC. So this new operating system name is Wayne OS and this is based on Chromium. So simply you can say this is a Chrome OS for PC. And as they say here, it is going to be safe and lightweight free OS. So, you know, the Chrome OS are already safe and lightweight. So you can expect the same thing from this, but this is for PCs. So if you want to follow me uh, to this journey, like uh, I'm, I'm about to test this, I'm about to install it. So you can follow me. I will put link in the description. You can go here and uh, just follow me and get the OS. So, and one more thing, you don't even have to install it on your PC. You can install it on your USB and test it. If you like it, then you can install it. If you have really old PC, which doesn't even run uh, Windows, not even a, a Linux, then you can try this out. This is pretty fast because I have already tested this. <laughs> That's what I can say so far. Okay, so you'll see. So yeah, once you're here, uh you to download the os you can simply click on release here uh, just click on wayne os whatever the latest is okay this is the latest one and when wayne os usb 8g something like that just click on the latest one and it will download the file and i have already downloaded this so once you have downloaded the file you get confused but how do i put it into my usb don't worry just click on how to section and after that, uh, click on the last one, how to install WinOS in a USB flash drive. Just click on it. And uh, here you can use one of these uh, tools to make flashable USB drive for WinOS, AKA Chrome OS. Just call it a Chrome OS, okay? So you can use WinWriter. There is a link, just click on it. And you can also use Win32 Disk Manager, click on it. And actually I used uh, Chromebook Recovery Utility. If for some reason, if it does not work, you can use any of other, okay? One of them will surely work, okay? So I'm gonna click on it and download it. I have already downloaded it, okay? And uh, here, Simply what you're gonna do is, if you use Chrome, Chromebook Recovery Utility, click on this gear icon, setting menu, and uh, click on use local image. That's how you use it, okay? And actually, before you use that, you have to extract the Wayne OS that you downloaded. It will be in zip. Once you extract it, it will give you a new, new folder and uh, just click on it and it will give you the new .bin file and you have to choose that file, okay? And you have to put your USB flash drive. I have actually already made everything, okay? I'm ready to do the test, ready to show you because I don't want to waste any time. Just put your USB flash drive and make sure that your USB flash drive is at least eight gigabyte. So I have 32 gigabyte of USB flash drive and uh, I just installed it. Uh, once you put your USB flash drive, click on continue and it will do its job. And then now you have to restart your PC to install or just to test WinOS. So let me quickly pull up my phone and uh, I'm gonna record using my phone my laptop and I'm gonna show you there. Okay, give me a second. So now put your USB flash drive into your laptop or PC. So I have put that in my laptop. That's what I use for test, okay. And uh, turn it on and enter into the um, BIOS menu, okay. Uh, by pressing F12, F10, 11, it could be anything, okay? So that's my uh, BIOS menu, okay? And now I'm gonna choose, uh, let me bring my keyboard a little bit closer. I'm gonna choose, uh, you can either use UEFI boot or legacy boot, it doesn't matter. So if your system is 
already installed on UEFI, then I recommend you guys to use the UEFI. If your system is installed on by, uh, legacy mode, then you can, you know, it's a common thing that you just simply understand. You are very intelligent. I know that. Okay. So I, my systems are installed in uh, uh, UEFI mode. So I'm just simply going to use that mode. So I'm going to choose my flash drive, which is jet flash transcend 32 gig and i'm gonna hit enter and it will reboot our pc and it will show us something but you don't have to do anything just let it go and it will automatically boot our new win os aka chrome os for pc so let's see how it works i know it's you know as i said <laughs> i've already tested this so it's uh, pretty fast I mean, much faster than any other OS because it's a Chrome OS and you know it. Chrome OSs are very fast, but uh, uh, let me just go forward here. <laughs> so I need to log in here. So let me log in because I have already done the all, all the setups things, you know. So it will ask you to set up your uh, Chrome OS for the first time when you open it. I have already set up this. So you just simply log in with your Google account, that's it. Just like you set up anything else. Uh, choose Wi-Fi and uh, choose your account and done. That's it, that's what I did. Okay, that's what it will ask you to do when you open this for the first time. And I'm let me log in this. All right, I'm logged in. Now, this is our uh, Wayne OS. So, even in USB, I, I, you know, this is really fast. It's not installed into our hard disk. Even in USB, it's really fast. Let me open this like Chrome Web Store. You can see it feels like I'm using it in my disk and still not. I'm not using it in my disk and it's super fast. No lag, no nothing else. So imagine if you install it on your old laptops or PCs which cannot run Windows or Linux, this is going to be super fast. So that's that. And only downside of this Chrome OS is that it does not have a Android support. That's a sad thing, but uh, to make this OS fast and secure, I think developer purposely removed those because uh, having a more utilities, more features into a OS makes it a little bit slower. Uh, as you know, I have made a video on Fedi OS, which is similar to Chrome OS. That's another thing, another Chrome OS for PC, but that uh, Fedi OS aka Chrome OS comes with everything. Uh, it comes with uh, Google Play Store. Yeah, and compared to that, this is very fast, way faster because it does not have Android and it doesn't have to load Android system. So that's why it is faster than Fedi OS. So since I have made a video on Fedi OS, I know how fast it is. It is still fast, but the Wayne OS is much faster than Fedi OS because it does not have lots of things. It only has the Chrome OS and uh, Chrome OS is basically a one browser running everything. And that's it. That's what the Chrome OS is for. It's for online, online thingies, I guess. <laughs> that's what you can say. So, and, uh, but you can actually enable um how do you enable it okay let me yeah you can actually enable linux yeah here you can see uh but if you want to run a linux applications and linux environment onto your chrome os or you can say win os yes it has a linux support and you can turn it on and um yeah that's it. This is like very impressing, to be honest, you know, so yeah, I don't have anything else to say, <laughs> you know, to make this OS so fast, they even didn't even add a, uh, any wallpapers. Very sad. <laughs> they should include some kind of wallpaper. This thing, uh, this background is blank. It has nothing. <laughs> 
uh, I think we can download this. I'm gonna download this. Yeah, make it look a little bit better because wallpaper won't hurt your PC. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. I think it's a, a really good OS for free. You know, this is a free Chrome OS for PC. So if you have a really, really old laptop or PC that doesn't run anything well, try this out. This is pretty good, you know. It will uh, revive your computer from death. It has all the features. I think it's, uh, it is also latest. Um, let me check about Chromium. Yeah, it is almost, I don't know what is the latest version of Chrome, but uh, I think it's latest. Uh, the current version that WayneOS is using is uh, 9.91.04 something. So let me check real quick. So according to Wikipedia, the latest one is 89. <laughs> Wikipedia is uh, really slow, I guess. So uh, we have 91, which is like three steps above what Wikipedia is saying. So you can say that, uh, yeah, this Chrome OS is up to date, latest, and it's an official build. Yeah. Maybe the, the stable Chrome OS version is 89, but the Chromium, Chromium, stable Chromium version is 91. So this is the latest and greatest. So that's a, that's a good thing. That's it, hope you enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments, what do you think about this Wayne OS, Mr. Wayne Batman OS. Yeah, <laughs> this actually, the Wayne, uh, Wayne name reminds me the movie of Batman and uh, uh, it's kind of funny, Mr. Wayne. Yeah, I, I'm sure you have watched the Batman movie and you know who the Wayne is. Yeah, <laughs> that's it, hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, as I said, let me know in the comment section below what do you think about this. If you have any old laptop or PC, try it on that. It's amazing. And uh, rest, uh, if you don't understand, just go to the website and go to the how to section and there you will understand everything like how to install and everything. Okay, that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. I will put link in the description for the website. You can go there and uh, have fun with your Mr. Wayne OS or Batman OS. That's it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye bye.